Hi, I'm Alice and I'm from the countryside in Lincolnshire. I got into jewellery and silversmithing when I was very young. Um, at primary school there was um, an after school jewellery club which my mum's friend ra ran um, and then she actually ran a leather birthday party for me making jewellery and then from there I got into metalwork and went to the Glasgow School of Art to study jewellery and silversmithing. So what I like about jewellery and silversmithing is the mix of subjects. Um, so at A-level I studied maths, chemistry and art and I did history as well. And I, for me it combines all of those uh, things that I absolutely love. So it also combines my background, my family background in engineering um, and it's kind of like creativity um, in, in engineering on a small level. And then also my love for history. So I, I'm really excited that I'll be creating pieces for the future that will last for generations. So my work is about crystal formations and rock formations, and that's my inspiration. So for my brooch that I'm making, it's inspired by amethyst. I'm using the technique of chasing and repousse, um, using niobium as my metal, uh, which is um, not used much in the jewellery world, but it's great because you can form these amazing crystal shapes. Um, and then it will have a backdrop of gold, which will frame it really nicely. And then for my dish, which I'm making, uh, I'll have the new technique of engraving that I've learnt here and it will have crystal shapes throughout the top of the dish which give a 3D illusion effect. And this piece is something that could be used at dinner parties um, as a central table piece for things like nuts and snacks and things. For me this competition has been fantastic because I've really been able to push my making skills so before this I would never have made a dish or thought to have made one but I did lots of sampling in copper and have really pushed the boundaries of what I've been making um, so this dish has actually sort of been pushed out and chased um, these shapes here um, and uh, it's been able, I've been able to work on a much larger scale than I usually would have done and for the brooch, obviously I've been able to add gold to it, um, which I wouldn't have been able to have done otherwise.